Kick back, relax, and let your Christmas dinner settle. From new takes on old classics to the fictional future and some political portrayals, Hollywood has a gift for everyone this holiday season. I want you to be my VP. I want you. You're my vice. New in theaters this yeah, Christmas Secretary Day, Vice. Vice. Christian Bale portrays and Dick I Cheney as vice president to George W. Bush. What we're seeing, bureaucracy, military, energy, and uh, foreign policy. Yeah, right. And explains the quiet role he played in reshaping the country as we still know it today. Welcome to Harvard Law School. I'm Ruth Bader Ginsburg. Also new in theaters today, on the basis of sex. You must see the opportunity this case represents for men and women both. It chronicles Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg's challenging rise to the nation's highest court and looks at her struggles for equal rights. You will lose, Ruth. And when you do, you will set the woman's movement back 10 years. You don't get to tell me when to quit. And if you're trying to stay away from politics this Christmas, there are three other movies already on the big screen getting rave reviews. The women of Marwin protect me. Massachusetts native Steve Carell stars in Welcome to Marwin, a special town he creates where he can heal from a devastating attack. I thought I heard you yelling for more gumbo. No, no gumbo. Mary Poppins returns decades later. You seem hardly to have aged at all. Really? One never discusses a woman's age, Michael. To help the bank siblings through a difficult time in their lives. I am the protector of the deep. And Aquaman, which just debuted at number one at the weekend box office. Atlantis has always had a king. Now I need something more. The high action thriller takes you to the underwater kingdom of Atlantis, where Aquaman must be a hero to the world. But what could be greater than a king? Aquaman made nearly $70 million in its opening weekend. In the newsroom, Elena Pinto, 7 News, today, New England.